Hi friends! Plasma arc lighter is pretty useful thing. There are a few videos at my channel about assembling such high voltage devices. I've done several lighters before, but all gave away to my friends. And now I decided to do one for me. This time I'm not real up a high voltage transformer by myself, because bought a Chinese unit. This is high voltage converter with built-in oscillator circuit. Input voltage is from 3.6 to 6 volts, and the output is about 20 kilovolts. The unit is completely filled with resin. At AliExpress it costs around three dollars. Link is under the video. Among sun dries at home I found a suitable enclosure of Chinese turbo lighters. Next I need a well-known charger board for one lithium battery. It is based on the TP4056 chip. The charge current of about one ampere. I installed board without protection. I used exactly this because the high voltage converter consumes from the battery current up to four ampere. But the protection system in such controllers will turn off battery at a current of 3 amperes. Therefore, I recommend buying a separate protection board about 5 ampere. I didn't put such protection. This is bad and detrimental to the battery. But I will use the lighter rare and I will not forget to recharge in time. I changed maker USB connector to more convenient for my purpose. The popular battery of 18650 standards is unfortunately not suited to the box size. Therefore, I put battery of 18490 standards. It is a little shorter. Its capacity is 1200 milliamperes an hour. Link to purchase is under the video. Battery and charger board are wrapped in the isolation cloth tape to avoid short circuits with the housing, because it is made of metal. The board has two SMD LEDs indicators. They can be replaced, for example, to 3mm LEDs and to fix on the box in order to see the charging process. But I didn't make, I was lazy. I was thinking about the switch long time, then he found a board from the CD drive. Next to the motor is momentary switch. I connected this way. I was afraid that it wouldn't be able to switch currents up to 4 ampere, but all right. It works great even if it is turned on a long time. This is the full circuit. Protection board, as I said before, not being established. After assembly, carefully check the connections and the work of charger. Next, I put all into the housing. It remains only carefully to place high voltage wires. It is recommended to place them away from the low voltage parts and from each other. Although they are in isolation, it is better to ensure. As a high voltage contacts use pin from the AC plug, slightly I shortened them. I have fixed them on the basis of not foiled fiberglass and filled with epoxy resin. To get the arc always at the same place made small sharp bumps. Between them the air resistance is less than that between the main pins. Hence the arc will be exactly there. We proceed to the tests. Ignition of paper is easiest. Plastic melted a little at first and then lights up. Can be comfortable to use to ignite gas stove. This device has several advantages compared to usual lighters. Firstly, it is a trouble-free operation. Second, is not afraid of high winds. Even if you strongly blow to the arc, it not breaks. The third, it is more universal, suitable for long trips. The charge is enough for a long time and can be recharged from power bank. But do not forget about the precautions of used high voltage devices. If you touch the operating lighter contacts, could get an unpleasant shock and a small burn. Not fatal, but unpleasant. It is strongly recommended to add safety lock in design to avoid inadvertent turn on, or provide main switch with protection cap. All necessary links are under the video. If you like the video, please share with friends. Thanks for watching. With you was Akakasyan.